Good Tuesday to you. It is August 9th. I'm Ashton Altieri back to school for Aurora Public Schools today. And it's going to be hot, it's going to be dry, it's going to be unhealthy for sensitive groups. So young children, older adults, those with respiratory problems, uh, discouraged from spending too much time outdoors. It is going to be another ozone action day for us. Our 29th day of the season so far. Last year at this point we had 48 days. So while it hasn't been a great ozone season, it's been better than it was last year. We've had fewer days uh, with trap pollution because of all the heat. Ridge of high pressure is going to move from southwest Colorado today up into southeast Wyoming by later this week. This is the high that we often track this time of year as it wobbles around the uh, mountain west. It, it sort of determines just how much moisture is going to be in our air. It's going to be really just the mountains over the next few days that have enough moisture to get maybe a late day thunderstorm or two. So mountain storms only through Friday. And then by the weekend, we could increase moisture enough here along the front range for maybe a late day shower or storm. It's possible Saturday, a little more likely Sunday, and especially in the Monday of next week. Here's the first alert future cast. You can see where the storms will be limited to today. Far southwest Colorado, Durango up Highway 550 over toward Cortez as well on Highway 160, those areas. Uh, and then as we get into tomorrow, storms may get a little bit closer to the front range, maybe Eagle County, Summit County, Lake and Picking County, so Aspen Vale. Breckenridge, Leadville, etc. Maybe a late day storm tomorrow. I'd be surprised if those areas get a storm today. Temperatures for Denver in the front range will be in the 90s for at least the next six days. Not much will change. We're not going to go up or down. Things are going to be pretty consistent. Pretty unusual, uh, frankly, for this time of year. Usually we've got a little bit more variability day to day, but this time around, it's uh, pretty simple. Through Friday, sunny, hot, dry. Saturday, small chance for a late day thunderstorm. Uh, Sunday, 40% chance for a late day storm. By Monday, we're up to a 60% chance for storms. Uh, the Broncos taking on the Cowboys. Dallas is in town uh, for preseason football. 7 p.m. Saturday, 86 at kickoff. By the end of the fourth quarter, we'll be at 78. Chance for rain right now. Looks to be 20% or less. Hey, don't forget, Lawrence, got your latest forecast coming up tonight on CBS 4 News at 5, 6, and 10. So we'll see you then. And of course, we got your latest weather all day over on the stream, CBS News Colorado. Have a great Tuesday. We'll talk to you soon.